When you watch this video, you'll discover a simple and efficient way to bring animated characters to life. If you've ever wanted to create characters that walk and dance with ease, you're in the right place. Today, we're excited to guide you through the process of animating characters quickly and effortlessly. So, without any hesitation, sit back, relax, and let's dive in. Here are the three steps to create this animation video. First, use Leonardo AI to create characters and backgrounds. Next, animate your characters with Viggle AI. Finally, edit your video with CapCut. Let's start with Leonardo AI. Begin by creating your characters and background using Leonardo AI. Once you're done, we'll move on to Viggle AI. Viggle AI provides a range of features including Mix, Animate, and Ideate. As you may have seen in our previous video, today we're focusing on the Animate feature. Once logged in, select an Animate channel you like to work, navigate to the prompt box at the bottom, type Animate, upload the image, paste a prompt for an action selected from the Viggle AI prompt box. Select the green background and ensure Fine Tune is on. Let Viggle do its magic. After that, we'll proceed to work on the next characters until they're all animated. After finishing with Viggle AI, we'll move on to CapCut for video editing. First, we need to import all the necessary videos, background image, and background music. Once that's done, move the background to the timeline. Next, focus on the first character by adding their walking video to the timeline. Click the Remove BG tab and remove the green background. Check the chroma key and pick up the color, then move the intensity to 100%. Adjust the position and size of the character. Once satisfied, set up keyframes for position at the beginning of the video. Then, move the playhead to the end of the clip. Then, move the character to another position you like and set up another keyframe at the end of the clip. Repeat this process for the second character's walking video. To reverse the second character's direction, click on the mirror icon. Next, we add the ballet dance video of the first character. Move it to the upper layer of the timeline, a little bit ahead of the last frame of the walking video. Remove the green background and adjust the size and position. Additionally, ensure that the face direction matches the direction of the walking video to match the first one for a smoother transition. Once you're satisfied, cut the clip at the last frame of the walking sequence and remove the initial part. Then, proceed to the lower layer and repeat the process for the second character. Then, you'll also need to synchronize the movements of both the first and second characters. Once you've finished, play the video. Notice that both characters are not synchronized. Ensure they are synchronized by following these steps. Select the walking clip of the first character. Move the second keyframe of the walking video forward. This might be a bit challenging, so ensure you can adjust it properly. Then, fine-tune both videos to synchronize them accurately. Okay, let us see the final result.